How do you feel about what we saw out there for the spring game and what you guys were able to accomplish over these last couple weeks? Uh, for the spring, we covered a lot, you know. From last year, we really had a little, a little buckle, you know. But this year, we covered a lot. Like O line, we got better. Run game, we could have, we could have did better run game, but it, yeah. That's. Asking Kylan and Quincy, they said, we saw some good things. There's definitely some stuff to, to clean up and and kind of get in a little bit more sync. How good can y'all's group be, though, when when you do hit your stride, get things clicking? If y'all reach your potential, how uh, how much fun can this offense be? Well, it could be great, fun, like really fun, because we have a lot of weapons, you know? So uh, a lot of defense can't focus, focus on that one player. So once they focus on that one player, we got other other weapons and stuff, you know. By that same token, when you have guys like you and Jace and some other teammates in the backfield that can can each tote the rock and, and make some plays, particularly as a young guy, how helpful is that to have one of the older guys be be back there and, and y'all kind of play off each other and compliment one another? That's uh I like it because Jace taught me a lot of things. I look I really look up to him and uh by him being in the backfield with me make me feel more comfortable, you know? And uh, put a lot of pressure on me because I got an older person. Yeah. And by the time he graduates, I'll be uh, mentally ready for that for that uh, start. Being a bigger leader and yes, stuff sir. like that. When you look at you having a, a nice freshman year to, to where you are now, let's take me back to the day one of, of football in the fall to where you are now. What have you been most proud of that you've kind of seen in your development or something you feel like you've got a better handle on or, or anything of that nature? I like, uh, from my first, I was kind of nervous and stuff. And uh, I couldn't, I really, from my first, I was just like, my mind wasn't ready for that. But this year, my mind was, but for, right, for, for right now, right. my mind is, uh, I learned a lot of things from back, back from my ninth grade year. And uh, I'm really, the, the game feels like it yeah, slowed it's down like, a little bit for you. Yeah, for my uh, ninth grade, it was kind of fast, but now it slowed down because I knew what's going on. Yeah, you've heard from some colleges early. Troy made, you know, extended the first offer, and some others have checked in. You mentioned Tulane is one that you know has, has kind of paid some attention to you. Who are some of those other schools, and what is that like as a young guy to start hearing from some colleges already? Uh, it's kind of it's, it's great, you know, but sometimes. Kinda, it's kind of hard too because you got that pressure on you and like stuff going through your mind but still like being being looked at as a young everybody can have the kind of opportunity you know, because a lot of colleges don't really focus on people that are young so I'm glad to have colleges looking at me while I'm young right now. Are you trying to get to some camps and stuff in June? Uh, yeah I'm trying to get to uh, Tulane, LSU, UL, Troy, uh, more in like hey, Alabama, Florida State.